Y'all already know the vibe, man. What we gonna be talking about today, y'all? We gonna be talking about a sad, a sad topic today. And the topic is the customer that picked up his bike. That's well, first we gonna start with this. The customer that says he's been riding for ten plus years, right? The customer that said he's been riding for ten plus years, but he don't know what kind of two cycle or two stroke tape. He don't know what kind of two two cycle oil or two stroke tape. I thought two cycle is the oil that a two a two stroke tape. <laughs> what are you talking about? See, see the kind of stuff I get. And then it's like they want to hit me up at ten at night about questions like this. What would it agitate? How, how could it not agitate you? Can y'all let me know? And like I told you, I'm gonna keep y'all updated with everything that that I come against. You feel me? Everything that that comes to me, I'm gonna keep y'all updated on the BS, man. This man said he's been riding ten years plus. He probably in his forties. You know what I'm saying? He's in his forties. He got a two stroke, obviously. And he actually came and picked up a bike from me. Like I'm trying to understand when you pick your bike up. Why didn't you ask me that? But see, that's the thing. See how people is, they'll go to like, see, see how stuff just come out? Yeah. He talking so good in front of me. Oh yeah, boy, I've been riding, y'all been riding 10 plus years. Um, You know, I've been doing this a long time. I've been doing this. I done had 85, I done had everything. Banshees, two strokes, and all this. But he asking me, how do you mix the oil? <laughs> you asking me how to mix the oil. What kind of gas? Oh man, what kind of gas goes in a two stroke, y'all? <laughs> I should I should just say mix the diesel with, with, with motor oil. <laughs> mix diesel and motor oil and put it inside your two stroke. That's what I should that, 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 that's really what I should say. And just to see what he see if he'll really do it. Yeah, that's the mixture on diesel with uh four ounces to one gallon in motor oil. It's just the stuff I see, y'all. It's just the stuff I see that happens on, on here. It's just I can't believe the stuff I see. Now, it just, and, and see, it's really the thing how he was bragging, like, he's more of a rider. Like, he, he rides for real. Like, he don't care about how he's more of a rider than a, you know, wheel stand or whatever. He's been doing this uh, 10 years plus. That, that, that what caught me. And he said he's been doing it so long that he even got tired of riding at this point. He just pulled out and ride when he feel like, because he a vet now. <laughs> but my thing, and see, I know this person. I've been riding uh, 10, 10 years plus. But you're not going to hear me ask somebody, hey, bro, what kind of what um, kind of two-cycle oil a two-stroke take? And what kind of gas you take? Y'all going to look at me like, hey, what? You've been riding 10 years plus. You've been riding two-stroke for 10 years plus. So you should, you should not do this with a magic wand. You don't even have me. It ain't even a second guessing. Like, he could do this in his dream with his, in his eyes closed. Mix oil. When he said that, my heart dropped. I said, I hope he don't blow the V-Touch up. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he don't destroy the V-Touch and blow his bike up. I said it in my head. Do you think this is something that you could look up on YouTube? I mean, on oh YouTube. my God, that's what we got smartphones for. You could easily go on Google on your iPhone, your whatever you got, Android or whatever. Everything got Google now. You could just go on Google what kind of two-cycle oil a two-stroke take. And guess what's going to pop up? A bottle that say two-cycle oil. A whole bunch of them. Whole bunch of different oils. But see, at the, the end of the day, by, his, by him saying what kind of two-cycle oil a two-stroke take, it's like a two-stroke takes two-cycle oil. Like, yeah. you mean what kind of brands? Is that what you're trying to ask? Like, what kind of brands of two-cycle oils? But you could either way you could look it up. You could even look it up by your bike specifically. That's what I'm saying. You could run any kind of two-cycle oil in a two-stroke. <laughs> like he was trying to ask me what kind of oil goes yeah. in a two-stroke. Why do you think he told you that he's been riding for ten years? Why he told me that? Because he didn't want to make himself sound like a lemon. He didn't want to make himself feel like a lemon because he feel like he got something to prove to me. Because he know the type of stuff I do. Like I do lemon update stuff, so he felt like Does he even care? I don't care about that. As long as you're not doing limit, and see, he trying to prove that he's so much not a limit, but now it's like to the point you you didn't turn into a limit just by faking it. Yeah. Cause by you faking it, and the truth coming out now, hit me up during dinner time <laughs> when I'm eating chicken and whatever I'm eating. When he looked at when he looked when I looked at my phone, I seen that that stupid message. 
I want to spit all my food out. <laughs> I want to spit my food out. I swear I want to spit my food out. I lost appetite when he said that. Cause I remember what he told me. He been riding 10 plus years. I even been riding 10 plus years, fam. Oh my God. See, you trying to prove that you so much of a, like a Superman or something, like you, you, you know what near a limit. Would you have thought of him differently if he would have just told you, hey, look, I, I bought this dirt bike, I just started riding, you know? I respect him. i help him then. Yeah. Then I would help him. See, what made me not want to help somebody like that, the fact that you said in my face and you lied. And see, we had a good conversation about it, like, oh yeah, boy, you, you be riding for real and... You know, you be riding in the sand and like we talk about good stuff, trails. You like, yeah, boy, I've been riding everywhere, but you can ride all these different places. You and see what really killed me. He was like, that what killed me too. He like, yeah, the gas, the gas tank empty. I don't got no more gas. So what kind of gas and what kind of two cycle oil do it take? But if you've been riding on trails and tracks and everything, you done ran through at least a hundred tanks of gas. Yeah. So how don't you know what gas and oil is taking us to gas tank? And see, that's what, and that's how I always catch people. But see how people try to like play this manipulation thing with you again? Like you try to catch me. I always catch them in the end, like I caught him. And now I'm thinking this, telling them again. <laughs> so he was gassing himself up for you. He gassed himself up. But for what though? I rather you just tell me this, this is your first two stroke. Yeah. And then I knew you were fried, though, without him telling me he fried, he said up. Uh, Oh yeah, V, what kind of ratio are you run? I say 30 to the one. He, he tapped me in his notes on his iPhone. Just like he tapping that, like, cause he was like taking notes. Mm -hmm. He was taking notes on the, um, you know, the phone, whatever, trying to save it. But just how he was taking notes like that, all you gotta do is go on Google and type in what kind of two cycle or do a, a such and such take. Yeah. Or YouTube. Or YouTube. <laughs> Ooh, man. <laughs> See, People be forgetting. I do the V test. I'm not a dictionary. I'm not Google. I'm not Google. I'm, I do the V test. And going back, like, I just don't understand why people could be so comfortable to hit me up 10 at night, 9 at night. Well, I'm not thinking about no two cycle oil at 10 at night. I'm playing GTA or something. <laughs> you know? I'm eating. Yeah. I got my feet up. I'm deep off in the sheets. Real deep. With the AC blown. You know what I'm saying? I'm feeling good. So what makes me think I'm finna uh wake up out my dream to tell you what kind of two second oil you need? That's just not gonna happen. And didn't he tell you like before you went on this? Wait, 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 hold up. <laughs> Click. <laughs> Look, I just wanna ask about that oil to be. Let me hang up on you for you to destroy my appetite. Cause he destroyed it like 40%. So I felt my like, as he kept talking, my appetite kept going lower and lower. Like, it almost got to that middle mark. And we were like, wait, 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 wait. And I hung up and said, beep. Then he kept rising <laughs> back up. He kept going back up. I, I, I Cause he made it seem like it was urgent, right? Yeah, like he was in the light. It's like he, like he needed to be rushed to the hospital or something like that. Yeah. But wait, wait, I'm getting the heart attack. You doing about oil, bro. It's not that hard to pick up your phone. Huh? At that time, late at night. Yeah. It's not that hard to pick up your phone and go on Google. Like, and, and see, you old, I, I don't understand how you don't know about Google yet. Did he call you a second time? In the morning. What time was it? Like, ten, ten, nine in the morning, bro. <laughs> Nine in the morning on a Sunday. <laughs> Sunday. Nine in the morning on a Sunday, bro. Was that the first person that called you this morning? Yeah. First person out of anybody. And the last person. And my own mama, grandma don't call me that early. He called me before they could call me. <laughs> before I ate breakfast, he called me. <laughs> That's when I had to tell him, like, go on Google. Look it up on Google. Did his phone call wake you up? Yeah, this phone call was like a alarm that I didn't set. It's like he set an alarm for me. And I don't like people set an alarm for me. I like setting an alarm for myself. So you started, I wear the pants. So you started your day with? With his alarm. <laughs> I started my day off of his alarm when he's not my boss. But that's what I'm starting to start turning my work phone off. 
on weekends, I'm gonna turn my, my, my work phone off. You can't even hit me up, no nothing. And I hate to have to block a customer. I swear to God, I hate to have to block a customer. So do you wanna tell people like what's a, do you feel like you have to tell like people should know what's a good time to come back? Like, That's what I'm saying. These days, Monday through Friday. Monday through Friday. Don't hit me up at nine in the morning on a Sunday. Like I'm your child or something. Or midnight. Or midnight, like we having a slumber party. Like I'm giving you the, the address to come have a slumber party with me. <laughs> like, I'm eating milk and cookies. Leave me alone. Yeah. Straight up. So you're not like 24 hours mechanic. No, I'm not a 24 hour mechanic. No, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> I don't care who you is. That's what a lot of people don't understand. I don't care who you is or nothing. This is a business. It's not a, it's not no, you know what I'm saying? No. You think because people see you on Instagram at a certain time? Man, I don't care if you see me just post a story on, on my Instagram page. Don't hit me up about no, talking about what your wife needs at a certain time. Straight up. Because yeah. I'm posting that for me. For my social media, for my person, my personal life. Don't Try to mix the two together. Just because you see me post a story on Instagram at 10 p.m., don't hit me up thinking we can talk about your wife. I don't care about your wife at that time. Yeah. So, like, you think it's, they're making it harder for you to separate your work life? And I ain't making it harder because I just, I just know I'm a blocker. But they I just, just tell them straight up. Like, they just think you're working all the time. No, I'm not working all the time. I'm not. I don't know how else to, to explain it to, like, to them. <laughs> I'm not really put, you know, about a good total of eight, eight customers on that list. I don't have a problem with putting, <coughs> I don't have a problem putting 20 more people on that list if I have to. On that, you know, on that lemon list. No, what do you call that list? The abandoned list? The yeah. customer life list? list? Yeah, the customer block list. Can you bring your tie, your, your, your tie in and get, get a tool put in it? Straight up, you, you abandoned for life. Once you, once you get that list, you do life. <laughs> and I didn't have customers like tell me before, like I had certain customers tell me before, like, yeah, V-Boy, I have to come ride with you on a Sunday. Man, look, we not, it's not no, it's not no friendship. It's just a, it's a business. So when I fix your bike, don't, don't try to hit me up on Sunday talking about let's ride. No, it ain't no ride. I'm eating milk and cookies, I'm chilling. You know what I'm saying? You, we're not starting a little pack thing with, I'm not starting a little pack thing with customers. That's not happening. Mm -hmm. I don't be thinking that. Yeah, but you gotta come, we gotta pull out and ride together one Sunday, you gotta barbecue and, if I wanna barbecue, I got a grill. I could barbecue on my grill. I don't have to call a customer and tell a customer. Pull up, boy, let's um, barbecue and, that's like, I might always say I do passive work with customers. That's, that, I might always say that, right? Every customer that come here, I do passive work with. Yeah, but come around me Sunday, boy. Let's do passive work. It's like the same thing. <laughs> no. That's why I be saying you got to separate the two, like the business and the personal thing, you feel me? Yeah. It's not no friendship, bro. It's a business, not a friendship. <laughs> Even with people I have known for years, like, you know what I'm saying, years. We not friends no more, you know what I'm saying? So what makes you think a, a customer just gonna walk up and then think it's just gonna be a, a best friend party out of here? We already had a problem with, with, the, other, with the other customer like that, I ain't gonna say his name. We already had a problem with that guy. That thing he tried to be my friend and figure me out. Oh, he ain't even figure yourself out. <laughs> you know, you know, I'll tie your own shoes. How you gonna tie my shoes when I tie your shoes? Feel what I'm saying? Yeah. But this one here, he know how to rock, know how to mix his oil. So who who been mixing your oil for ten years that you've been riding these so-called trails and tracks? No, you ain't got no chauffeur. Who your maid is? Tell them come mix my oil, right? Yeah. I'm trying to figure that out. And it's like it's free to be like real. You don't have to. That's what I'm saying. It don't cost a dollar to be real to keep it real, y'all. He just did that just just to because he feel like oh yeah I'm in front of V the V touch himself I gotta. Put on real good, but at the end of the day, you didn't put on real good because I wouldn't be making this video that I gotta make now. A reaction video. Because it just makes you look at them like a lie. Like a lame. Use a lame. Just for mine. And I'm here to tell them. 
No, this is, this is a limit out there. <laughs> Customer lying about a ride for 10 years and don't know how to use the door on the people. <laughs> that's, what I, that's what we have to talk about right now. A uh, matter of fact, customer says he's been riding for 10, I think he told me 20 years, he's been riding for 20 years to be exact. Customer says he's been riding for 10 or 20 years, but doesn't know how to mix two cycle oil, but ask, or I should put a part, but ask me how to mix two cycle oil. No, he asked what type of two cycle oil does yeah. the two But yeah, <laughs> customer says he's been riding for 10 or 20 years, but ask me what type of two cycle oil a two stroke takes. <laughs> and you, and you, it's literally in the question. Bro, in the question, it's two cycle oil. What you mean? What kind of two cycle, two cycle oil, two stroke tape? It takes two cycle oil, bro. <laughs> what are you talking about? What kind of two cycle oil do a two stroke tape? Two cycle oil. He asked the question with an answer, bro. Right, when he told me I want to break my phone and just get me a new number and a new, <laughs> new phone, he said that. I want to break my phone and just get a new number in the phone. I ain't even want him to ever like contact me ever again when he asked me that. That was one of the stupidest questions I ever, I ever seen in the history of getting a gear cycle. Or even in the V-Touch. See, now I'm glad I know that now because now I know he elusive. His mind is elusive. You got people who are, who are sitting in front of you and act like they're so smart. Like I've seen a lot of customers like that. Like they act like they're so smart and like they're talking to anybody, but you know, I, my face just look like this. I just look like, you know, <laughs> I just look like this, you know what I'm saying? But you don't know on the inside, like I'm, I keep saying I'm wise as a raccoon. Like anything I'm, I'm, I catch on everything. But you sit here, like he, he want to come that thing, they know everything, and they can just sit there and like try to put their two senses in and throw, like put two and two together to make it seem like, oh yeah, this boy know what he's talking about. But the whole time, I didn't already pick you apart like 30 different times. Like, okay, he said he's been around 10, 20 years, but now he asked me how to mix the, mix the two cycle gas. So, okay, he's been around 10 years, it's 32 to 1. Now you're picking his, now you pick his phone up. Okay, what you say, G? 32 to 1? What? Okay, what else? 32 to 1 or 4 well, ounces? I could just said it's my first two stroke. Yeah, so now I'm like, okay, I already see what time it is. You want to keep that thing, they know everything, got all the sense. But the whole time, you're really a limit. Like, you're, you're, you, 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 a worm. you're a worm, you're a limit together. <laughs> so I already put you together already. You know what I'm saying? I already put him together, like, pretty good. You want to keep that thing, they know everything, but I don't know nothing. Mm -hmm. And you're flat. Yeah. Straight up. I speak the truth. See, see, see the difference? How, how I speak the truth on a situation? I don't sit here and hold nothing in. And, nah, I'm, I'm going to say what it is. If you don't like it, you don't like it. I'm going to say exactly what I feel and what it is. This is what I feel. You say you know how tense from here, but you're not this oil. I know what kind of oil goes inside your gas tank. Oh, matter of fact, you don't know what kind of gas goes inside your gas tank. In a gas tank. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what kind of gas goes inside a gas tank. Check your people, man. Check your people, man. Let me know they check your people. You know what I'm saying? You know, I, 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 you got any more questions? That's pretty much it. Yeah. But yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think about this. This guy's been around 10, 20 years, but you don't know what kind of. Two stroke. Two, two stroke, two cycle, or. <laughs> or gas that goes inside two, two stroke. <laughs> let me know what y'all think. Um, but other than that, y'all are doing fives. You know, keep the limit energy at home, y'all, like I always say. But it's like the more I say it, the more they come to me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The more I say, like, talk about limit stuff, the more. I've been getting a lot of limit customers lately, though, a whole lot. They're like the one who bought a little translate with them. They're like, he been eating too much. He been eating too much pork and beans. Hot dogs or whatever he been eating. Mm -hmm. They're like, he got mad at me for making pick up his limit. But y'all check that video out, too. But, you know, hopefully he... Get that diet going so you can slim on up, you know what I'm saying? Oh Maybe he won't get tired or faint. That's why, had, that's why he had to bring me the bike, so he get too tired. He could figure it out. <laughs> Got to catch a heart attack trying to get that thing that beats up. But, but yeah, man, y'all know vibes. Y'all let me know what y'all think on this um, situation. But it, like like I said, man, y'all need any bikes, please hit me up on Instagram. Get it in your cycle, the V Touch. South Florida vibe. But other than that, we're going to go from there.